I want to use this street I took during the annual section to explain the concept of liquidity. When I started out with Bayesity's concept, one of the concepts that really gave me issues was the concept of liquidity. Why? Probably because I came from the background of traditional market structure, which believes that market moves, um, explains market movement based on higher highs and higher lows. It was like an obstruction to my understanding of um, liquidity. So if, for example, we have them both like this, we have price. For example, if we have price making low like this, a lower high like this, and then makes a higher high coming down, and it took out the low, I'll be kind of confused to whether this is a break in structure or just a grab of liquidity. Those were the challenges I was facing when I I was learning ICT's concert. But I think currently everything is coming together now. My understanding about liquidity has really shifted. I want to play a video of the analysis I made, how I was being the market before the setup presented itself. We have EU during the London session came out for sell side liquidity right here. And it's very obvious. I have this um this gap remaining here came and filled it completely, taking the sell side and started moving to the upside. This is the type of setup I'd like to be watching out for. And buy side liquidity just resting above here. And look how beautiful it is. So let's move down to the 15 minutes so I can show you how clear and beautiful it looks. The same that sell side have been engaged here already. I'm looking for the buy side liquidity resting above this relative equal highs now. That's a kind of clean setup. And as a thief currently, I'll be watching this in fashion fair for new gap. And by the way, this line that you are seeing here, this blue tick line, is an area of interest from the weekly time frame. Likewise, this one too. Okay, that was the video then. After I made the video, I started watching price and I was looking how it was delivering. The moment I saw that price traded into this purple rectangle I drew here, this purple extended rectangle I drew here, the moment I saw price traded into it, I started monitoring the swing. And by the way, this is an area of interest from the higher time frame, specifically the weekly time frame. So when I saw price traded into this purple rectangle, I started monitoring the swing. Immediately I had the swing here and seeing that price traded up overlapped the previous fair value gap here. I was okay for a, a buy, yes, because I was expecting this low to be a failure swing. So if you want to explain this thing using the advanced market structure that was taught by ICT now, this is going to be a short term low. Here we are going to have another short term low, and here is going to be an intermediary term low. So basically, that was what I was looking at, and everything played out as expected. I, because of the setup, the way I saw it, I had to hold it to completion. I didn't take any partial in this setup, and everything played as expected. So. I hope this video encouraged someone there if you are finding it difficult, especially this liquidity concept is something many people are finding difficult studying ICT's concept. So if you are finding it difficult, just stick around this with this channel. If you are not subscribed, just subscribe because we are going to be uploading more videos like this. And I want to tell you not to give up. Just continue learning and you see that everything will come together. So if this video was insightful, please do well to hit the thumbs up button. Thank you and see you in our subsequent videos.